Hello everybody! Today we are going to be playing Hunting Unlimited 2009. This is a game that I played quite a bit when I was a kid, and it's it used to be one of the better hunting games out there besides the Deer Hunter series. And I figured that we would bring this game to the channel today. Let me know if you guys would like to see any other older hunting games. I've got a few of the old Cabela's games and some of the old Deer Hunt games, so if you guys want to see any of those, let me know. And let's get into this. So this game has missions and it's also got the free hunt. Today we're just going to do free hunt. But if you guys want to see some of the story, let me know. I think it's only fitting that we go to Africa and hunt some elephants because that is something that Call of the Wild does not have. And a lot of people want. So we're just going to put these to... Uh, we'll do mid population for now. That is one of the cool things about this game is you can adjust the amount of animals that are on your map which is something that I think Call of the Wild needs. It needs some sort of a difficulty system so that if you want to you can play on a harder difficulty but anyway we're gonna, gonna go here in probably just clouds I'd say and we already got everything set up actually we do need to get rid of the nine and we'll probably go with probably the 300 or actually the 308 since Call of the Wild does not have a 308 we will get to use it here now we're gonna be using the 4 to 12 range finding optic so let's go ahead and hunt there's not really any calls for Africa so we'll just put on desert camo and call it good but let's spawn on top of oh we actually can't go on top uh, let's go up here in the north then and we'll kind of move south so let's go all right about 450 yards south from me all right so let's see Ooh, there's actually something right there that is a boar or a warthog I believe that's interesting the sensitivity for this game is kind of jacked up but we'll see what we can do. I actually see something else right there. It might do. That's a kudu. There's a couple kudu. So I think we will get out the 308. I don't remember how I switch. Oh. Um, apparently F shoots also. Wait, where did I just turn? Alright, this game's controls. You can you can tell that it's an older game. Because the controls are kind of wonky. Apparently F shoots and the sensitivity gets jacked up when you put your gun away. So that's kind of unfortunate. We're going to have to try and work around it. So I will see you guys again once I find an animal. Alright, so we have found those kudu again. Yep. Time, hopefully we can get this guy. Looks like we got a vital shot. Body Put shot. another one in him just to be sure. But he should That's be going funny. down soon. Ah, maybe not. It actually might not go down. There's a lion. Um, all right. So we did get it down. It took three shots, though, so that's kind of unfortunate. But we will run up and claim this guy. I really want to find a lion. Or not a lion, but an elephant. I think finding an elephant would be pretty cool, considering Call of the Wild and the Hunter Classic don't have elephants. As far as I know, this is the only hunting game that does besides the Cabela series. Oh my gosh, there's a lion coming right towards us. Oh my gosh, we may have accidentally brain shot that guy. Ah, uh, well, I mean, either way, we got ourselves a lion down. So let's go check him out and see how big he is. I really don't know what the scoring is like in this game. It's been so long since I've played it. So we're just going to have to see 
how things are. If I remember right, the only thing that really changes is the actual body size of the animal. So here's our lion. Not too bad. Let's pick him up. And let's go grab this kudu now. There we go. There's a kudu. That's an awesome sight. Not too bad. Let's pick this guy up too. I don't remember what the bag limit is. All right, so we do have one more tag. We can kill one more animal. So we're going to try and find an elephant for the last kill. I want to keep going until we find an elephant. All right, so I have not been able to find anything else in the last 10 minutes. So I think what we're going to do is we will just call the hunt there and we'll go into another hunt. Uh, let's move these guys to the trophy room because I don't know what they actually look like in there. Let's see. Where is the trophy room? There it is. So I do have some trophies here that I got previously. I think this is the newest one. Or no, it would be this one. So it is bigger than what we had before. We got this guy right here. So yeah, there you go. There's a lion. Obviously, this is an older game, so the models aren't the best looking. But we're going to go ahead and go into another hunt and see if we can find ourselves an elephant. That's actually a really big kudu. I'm going to have to track it. There, we finally hit lungs. So this is not what we came here for. We've been trying to find some elephants, but I think that might be just as good. That was a pretty massive kudu. I don't believe I've ever seen one of that size. So that's definitely cool to get. Oh, I accidentally put my gun away. There goes the crazy sensitivity. Definitely not used to a game that does not have a jumping function. I tried to jump and just put my gun away instead. I better stop shaking. Look at this monster. Look at this monster of a kudu. What a beautiful animal. It's too bad it landed in the log. We will just have to look at this in our trophy room after we get done with this hunt. But let's keep looking around and see if we can come across an elephant. All right, so we actually have a warthog right here. I believe this is the first one that we've seen, so we will kill this guy. That would have enough penetration in real life, but I guess not in this game. That did not hit lungs at all. That one did, though, so we will get this guy down, fortunately. But let's go pick him up. I'm not quite sure what these guys are like. So we will have to see once we get up to him. There it is. There is our warthog. I believe it's a warthog at least. Let's see. Grab him. Let's see what it is. Oh, it is a wild boar. If I remember right, wild boars are not in Africa. Maybe they... Oh my gosh, there we go. There is an elephant. Right as I was talking about the boar, we find an elephant. Look at that beautiful creature. And we are going to kill it once we get a little bit closer. Because I don't really want to take a 500 yard shot on this guy. It's a little bit too far away and I'm not confident in my marksman skills in this game. So we will get a little bit closer and see what we can do from there. Alright, so he is sitting out at around 220 yards now. We're going to get a little bit closer. Because I do want to get more broadside. I don't want him to be angled at all. A quartering shot on an elephant just does not sound like a good idea. So we're going to move over here further to the right. Yeah, I think this should be good. We're going to let our character get his breath back real quickly. And we will now take a shot. That is a lung shot. put one more in him just to make sure he goes down and he is down that is our first elephant let's go see 
what this guy is like. I'm hoping that it's a little bit bigger than the one that I had got previously before I started doing uh, this video. We will see. We will see. I think this one is a lot bigger. It looked like it was a male. All right, here's our elephant. This one is looks like kind of a small one. Although this game does not really have the size of some of the animals down very well. well let's go ahead and bag that and go check it out. It was a cow, so it was just a female. That explains why it looks a little bit smaller. Uh, let's see what it looks like compared to our other one. I think our old one was actually bigger. Yeah, it's definitely bigger. The one we just killed is way smaller. Definitely smaller for sure. But here is that kudu. That is an absolute monster. Look at the size of this guy right here. And there is our wild boar. Don't really know what the difference between uh, the wild boar will be. Because this is the first one that I've killed. So we will have to see once we get another one. But I think we are going to end the video here, my dudes. I hope you all enjoyed. If you guys want me to play any of the other old classic games, let me know. I've got a bunch of the old Deer Hunter games and a few of the old Cabela's games. I've also got Hunting Simulator. So if you guys want to see Hunting Sim, let me know. But until next time, peace my dudes. I hope you have a fantastic day.